What's up guys and we are back with another video and today we are playing Hell of Neighbor and I read on the next week now but we're just going to start from the beginning. Hopefully we can be at two. I know how to beat it. It's just a bit complicated so you guys can take this as a tutorial if you want. Okay so we're going to start with from Act 1. And guys, I'm pretty sure like it's like when you press Windows speed when like you don't have a mouse. Like see I'm using my mouse right now and it doesn't show it. Just press enter to do that. And then like if, if you have an arrows button or whatever, you press that to whatever to do whatever you want. Okay. Yes. Okay, we refer from the beginning. without cuts, we'll see how far we can get. Okay, I know the controls because I've played this before. Yesterday was my first time playing and I got in Act 3. Because I knew what to do in Act 2 and Act 1. <gasps> you can't run, I'm trying to run. I'm literally... Okay, I already know where the red key is. And you guys can take this as a tutorial if you want. I know what to do here, like I said. I see the neighbor. This is the neighbor's house. This is our house. In Act 3, he steals our house and modifies it. So let's see if we can get into Act 3. So hopefully, so you guys can take this as a tutorial if you want. So basically you have to go around the back, grab some boxes, <gasps> as many boxes as you can. That's the neighbor. So basically, you get here, you jump up all the way to the top, and then you place two block boxes. And then you jump up here, you place the box, and then you jump, and then you just, you don't, you just jump. You just go and jump, you don't hold your shift key. Because if you just run and jump, then it will go too far. Okay. This kind of reminds me to get the blue key. So basically, you just grab the, the gold key. Okay. And then this is the car keys to the trunk. And basically, what you need is something important. Okay, we're gonna have to restart. We're 
gonna restart this after, okay? I'm sorry. Uh, again. Yes. Okay, I I'm pressing space because I don't like to restart. Can I am I faster than the ball? No, I'm not. Probably. No. The ball's round, so. Yeah. I'm not gonna and the way to like beat the neighbor in th in this in act one basically basically you have to like just do the power. And I've tried I've won so many times the neighbor got me so many times but I beat it and I got to act and proof evidence that I know how to record that I can and proof evidence that proof evidence that uh, what evidence uh, evidence um, that well there's not really evidence that I uh, I uh I completed Act 1 because I didn't really record anything. But I swear I did Act 1. I, I, I beat Hel I did. Well, I didn't really beat Hello Neighbor. I just. I was close. I was close. It's just. It's just the last part was kind of crazy. It wasn't too crazy. It's just annoying. Though. So that's why every time I beat Act 3, I get into the basement. I. We start it from Act 1 to Act 2. Act 3. And guys, I. I oh my, that glitched over there. That was cool. Not really, because the neighbor heard that. He heard that. He's hearing all of this. You don't need the crowbar, but you can pick it up if you want. You don't really need a shovel, there's a shovel in there. But the reason why you can't take it is... See, the window's too high to jump to, so you need a box. You place it. Can we be Act 1 and 2? Because I, I know how to play this game, and I think I can be... I can do this, guys. Do you believe, do you think I can do this? Because I think I can. Now you go know up. You grab the red key. Booyah. Uh, you don't need a magnet. Take the red key. Break the window. Oh, the neighbor's in there. Never mind. Okay, we're, we're in the basement already. Let's go. And that's how you be act one. That's then you open this laundry thing. You take that. Um, you you pick that up. Go over here. Flip the lever. Yes, what is it? Then take three boxes. Jarvis, we're from the morning chronicle. Two, three. I not for three. Uh, you have to go over here. Okay. Oh, hey, the and then you have to flip the lever again. Grab the chair. Open this. Smash the brick wall. And then you pick up your chair. Bad? Because chairs are taller than boxes. Basically, cha uh, one chair is one trash can. And one trash can or one chair is two boxes. So right now I have five boxes basically. And then you jump on the top. Don't worry, you're not gonna fall. Then you hold your shift key. And then you press up, hold W, and then you jump. And then you and then you uh, uh, push that. And then you uh, climb up here to escape. Then you go through your brick wall. You go through here, and then you flip the lever. Now the cutscene's gonna play, and then you have to run from the table. Then you have to run from the table.
guys, I'll show you how to be Act 2. And you can take this as a tutorial if you want. Okay, so basically you gotta wait until a boy pops up. You have to wait until a boy pops up. Then you can open it. Then you go through the vent, you pick up the vent thing, just drop it, then you go, you come down here, and then you go up the ladder, and then you're in Act 2. Boom. You come out of the neighbor's basement. I'll show you guys what to do in Act 2. So basically, you come here, you have to click this lever. Come up here. I know the neighbor here. Come here. You 
you want to do a few things first. You kind of want to do a few things. So this is a campfire room. But first, you want to come down here. Most importantly. Uh, that's for side mission. You don't really have to do that. That's the way to get to do another. This is locked. So basically, you go up this ladder. <laughs> so a, a nice way to do it is to first get the. I think you have to like do this though. Oh, I think that you can still beat the game. Now you need you need two boxes for this. I remember because I beat Act Two twice. Because I beat Act One, I beat Act One, Act Two twice, and Act One and Act Two twice. But Act Three I beat only once. The way to basically beat Act Three is. By, uh, you don't really have to get all the abilities, you just have to get, you just need the, well, I'm pretty sure, like how, like how Hello Neighbor used to be, you need to the, you need to the, thing on the, uh, double jump. No. I don't want to jump down there, and I know that it's, it should be a pool because I I turned it, but I ha I didn't do enough like clever things. But a way to do it quicker is just by doing two of the so like how I did like I just did two of the those thing images like the turn it and then. And then that made the water stop. So then I just came here quickly. And then this this is for a red the red piece. You just have to make the jump in there. You just have to like like open the door first. You have to jump. I know. I know this is embarrassing and failing. And then you get here, and then boom. Red key. And then you just come here. Get here. Come down. <clears throat> but you can, now you can unlock this. You don't need uh, anything. All you just need is red key. Hallelujah. And this is just another way to do it. You don't have to do it like this. You can like complete all. You can like um. You can like uh. You can do a different way. You can like get all the pipes. But this is how I like to do it. And then you have to escape. And then you be Act Two. And and I'm gonna skip that cutscene. Now we're in Act Three. These cutscenes are. Really and in order to like open the door, you have to wait for a, a letter to come in, and then you hold, hold the. So this is just a tutorial. If you guys want to take it, uh. So what I always do first in Act Three, I always first get the elevator or the ladder. Then I get the secret painting. Then I get the red key. Then I get the blue key. Uh, I try to get the train, and then that's it. And one time I actually got all the abilities. The crouch, the crouch one is probably the hardest to hear. Okay, now you hear a knock. Now the letter, and you press space to skip. I think it's like A to skip. Okay, so this is Act 3. This is not actually how Act 3 is, but it's how it looks for now. And, and that's the ghost cutscene. So, we're actually gonna listen to the cutscene now. So, we're gonna listen to the phone. What is it?
Okay. Okay, so first I'm gonna get the elevator. Or the ladder. People, some people call it elevator, some people call it ladder. And when you start Act 3, there's no cameras. First try, let's go. Now, we're gonna do something here, so. Okay, so wait, please. <gasps> you hurry. You go up the elevator. <laughs> okay, so I'll just show you guys this room first. So. This is if you want to get, that is if you want to get the green key, but that's not the green key, that music is the thing, that's not the green key, it's just part of getting the green key, because I'll show you guys something in a minute, so this is the chain track, there's barricades, and you have to like, in order to complete the red key mini game, uh, I, but, I, usually at this time I would have the red or blue key, but I'm just showing you guys action. And this is the painting right huh. here. So that's the painting. This. The power has to be on for the level to flip. Oh wait, no, 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 no. I want to get, fine. We'll get the red key first, then the blue key. Okay, what's this room? Um, what is he? I'm just opening doors to let him know. It's actually kind of dumb. And this is the red key. This is the shoe. Well, you actually. I guess you can use the shoe. And this is the crowbar. This is for the crowbar. Crowbar's there. But so we're gonna get the red key for now. So, like, you need a. I have to flex. Where is he? is important because because you actually need junk for the elevator plus you need it for the elevator you need it to get the red key you actually need the well you don't really need the red 
The thing just ran away. <laughs> hey guys, I have nothing to get now. And the reason why I'm pushing that lever is because that's how you get the red key. And I'll show you guys how I'm gonna get it when I push that lever. You need something like small, like these. I'm gonna use this because it's the smallest. I'm gonna use this actually to see if this works. And sometimes that can happen, so I'm complain. Because that's fun of the game. Okay. Yes! And then this opens, and then the red key. Then you. Voila! You have the red key. Mwah. Mwah. Th thank you, neighbor! You're so kind. Okay, I'm gonna leave the red key here. Cause then, cause first we're gonna do the red key mini game. I'm not gonna get the. I'm gonna get the magnet. Uh, come on! Close it on us. Oh, I thought we could close it. Hmm. Wait, can we get in? Oh no, we can't. Are you kidding me? I actually never realized that was going to work. You have to go down here. I'm not gonna make. I'm just making things easier for us in Act Three. Okay. And you're like, Josh, how are you gonna post this video? Because you're pressing Windows. Key. Because. Hallelujah. <laughs> I done. He's like, I killed my friend. Watch this. First try. See, look how good I am at this game. I'm actually gonna pick up the blue key. So that's the magnet. And that's blue key. And then you flick this lever, and then you grab the umbrella. Most important thing to use the umbrella. Grab the gold key. You don't have to magnet it, but for me it's easier. And then 
You do that. Pick up. You don't really. You actually need your goal key, and to have this is for all the cameras. You can shut it off. I don't like it. That's locked. So then you do that. Then you do this. Then you open that. I know where the crowbar room is, but I'm gonna have to get the crowbar. And the way to like su successfully have the crowbar, <sighs> nothing is metal here. That's glass. This is the only thing in my house that's metal. Oh, that's also metal. This is to see. I'm just. because I'm gonna use the train, so. Yeah. He doesn't have the camera installed there yet. And look how easy this is. I'm not, I'm just, I'm not gonna. So he's going up, but I need to go up. I kind of want to get the crowbar, but I don't want to. I'm going to bait. That's how I bait. And then... Where did I find the go? for the crowbar, but I dropped the mag. I dropped the magnet. 
So he doesn't know where I am? Bye.